YouTube, what's going on? Kyle again from e Pool Supply. Today we are back with Pentair's Creepy Crawly Little Rebel. This is a suction side pool cleaner meant for above ground pools. We're gonna tear into this and show you guys how to do some quick fixes. Stay tuned. All right guys, and we're back. So today we have a quick fix video for you on Pentair's Creepy Crawly Little Rebel Above Ground Suction Side Pool Cleaner. So as you guys can see, I already have the top shroud as well as the swivel assembly taken off of this. So if you guys wanna know how to get access to all of that, make sure you guys check out the links in the description. We've got videos that'll walk you through on how to do that. But for today, they're already off. Um, the quick fix that we wanna show you guys today is replacing this buckle clip. So this uh, actual buckle clip is very crucial to the functionality of the cleaner as it helps hold this top shroud down onto the cleaner which in turn also holds your swivel assembly down over the turbine which allows um, not only the hose connection for it but also protection to make sure that no other further dirt and debris can get into this turbine and into these uh, side gears to stop this cleaner from working. So. Again, make sure you guys check out the links in the description and we'll show you guys how to get all those off. Uh, but for today, we just wanna show you guys how to swap out this buckle clip. So there's actually not any kind of screw or glue or any other way to get this clip off without a little bit of actual brute force. So once you remove the top shroud and you remove your swivel so that nothing kind of falls off while you're trying to work with this, you're gonna see that the buckle itself is actually um, push into the frame of the cleaner. So in order for you to get it out, you have to go towards the frame of the cleaner, which I like to kind of rock it back and forth because it's plastic, um, depending on how long you've had this buckle or how long you've had the cleaner um, in and out of the pool, especially for above ground pools, um, you may end up snapping this off, which in turn, if you're replacing it, isn't a big deal. But uh, if you're trying to potentially set this one off to the side and maybe use it in cases of emergency. Make sure you just take your time in trying to get this out. So what I like to do is I'll actually slide one finger down here on the base of the frame underneath these rollers. And then, like I said, you're just gonna kind of rock it back and forth so that you undo each one of those clips so that you can actually push down towards the rollers, which will actually release the uh, buckle clip from the frame itself. So as you guys can see in the picture here, it does have its own little designated spot on the frame of the cleaner for this clip. And so to get it off, it's a little bit more of a pain in the butt than it is to get it on. Um, when you get your new one, it's just simply making sure that you get it on there and then you can just push up till it locks in and clips there for you. And then as you guys can see, it'll just move back and forth pretty freely for you. So. Make sure you guys check out the links in the description. We got a ton more videos coming your way on this cleaner and all of the cleaners out there on the market for quick fixes for you guys. I appreciate you watching. I'm Kyle with the Pool Spy. We'll see you next time. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Subscribe today if you haven't subscribed. Check out the links below. We got a lot more content coming your way. Thank you.